Today we're going to talk about setting your 2020 up for yield sense. The first thing you're going to do is back up all of your planting data so that you have it in duplicate. Enter in a flash drive that has at least 8 gigs of capacity into your side port of your 2020. And from the home screen go to Setup, Data, Export, and Field Data. And then you're going to Transfer All. Once this is complete, you can remove the flash drive and then wipe the planting data from the display. From the home screen go to Setup, Data, Delete, Field Data, and then Delete All. Once this is complete, then we can switch over to get it into YieldSense. From the home screen, go to Setup, Systems, Display, and then on the far right you're going to see Switch to YieldSense. Follow the prompts and it will boot over into YieldSense. The other thing you're going to want to do is go ahead and get the latest software update. From Precision's website, you can go to Support, and then SeedSense, and then select the software update for either your Gen 1 or Gen 2 display. Your Gen 1 display has two USB ports on the left hand side versus your Gen 2 only has one. Now that you are in YieldSense, you will want to double check the Combine setup by tapping Setup on the right. Then tap Combine. Make sure your Combine make, model, and measurements are correct, then tap Enter. Now you can select Harder to specify which crop you will harvest first. Review the listed measurements and make sure that they are correct. On the top right you will see head height. This is where you will set the maximum header height we will record yield. It is best to set this about 7 points higher than your highest cutting height. Finally, tap Make Active and Home. From the home screen you can tap on GPS on the top right corner to make sure you are feeding the correct GPS data in. On your John Deere 2630 display, to double check your Starfire Receiver output settings, from the main menu select Starfire Receiver and then Serial Output. You want to make sure that your baud rate is set to 38,400 and that your Hertz is 5 Hertz and that you have GGA, RMC, and VTG selected. The final thing to check is that everything's communicating correctly. From the home screen, go to Setup and Diagnose. Make sure everything's green. If you run any other problems, feel free to drop us a line, 208-250-3455. Until next time, make it a blessed day.